Hi friends, in this video I'm going to talk about Bitcoin API. This week I was spending some time to know about what is Bitcoin. So while I was learning about it, I found an API to track the Bitcoin price. So it was interesting, so I thought of sharing with you all. Cryptocurrency is a huge topic and it's going to grow a lot in future and there is a lot of things to learn in this topic. So what is a cryptocurrency? A cryptocurrency is a digital currency which is used for online transaction and for transaction it uses a method called decentralized transaction. Let's see the difference between centralized transaction and a decentralized transaction. For example, the centralized transaction, Mr. David would like to transfer $100 to Mr. Praveen. So he does the online transaction. So from his account, from the bank, it has been transferred to Mr. Praveen. So from his account, it will be deducted and it will be added to Mr. Praveen's account. So here the transaction is managed at single place and it will be faster because it happens only at the single place. It will be faster. This is one of the advantage. But the disadvantage is if hacker wants to hack the system, he has to hack at single place. So this is one of the disadvantage. Whereas the decentralized system, for example, Mr. David wants to transfer money to Mr. Praveen. So the transaction has to update multiple nodes. So one of the main benefits is it's very strong. But the disadvantage is it takes a lot of time because it has to update multiple nodes. For a single transaction, it has to update multiple nodes that's why it takes more time and compared to this system this is very secure because because if a hacker wants to hack the system he has to take control of multiple nodes instead of single nodes so that's the one of the advantage of decentralized transaction so what is a blockchain a blockchain is a digital and decentralized database which is continuously updated for online transactions so cryptocurrency uses this blockchain methodology so what is a bitcoin i'm not an expert i'm a beginner i'm just learning about it i just want to share my understanding here so each bitcoin is a computer file which is stored in a, a digital wallet it might be an app or in a computer. So people can send Bitcoins to your digital wallet. And then each single transaction is recorded using the technology called blockchain. So I already described about blockchain technology. It's a decentralized database used for cryptocurrency. So now I'm going to show you a small API to track the value of the Bitcoin. So first of all, what is an API? An API is application programming interface where it helps two applications to communicate these days a lot of web applications are using api for example facebook ticket booking applications banking applications so most of the applications are using api so when i was learning about bitcoin i was thinking is there any api to track the bitcoin value and i found one so in the left hand side i opened the chrome and entered bitcoin value dollars so it shows 54,751. and this is the api i'm going to execute now so we are https bitx.la so this is the api to track the bitcoin value so when i make the curl command it was displaying this json output so you can see here 54300 it's almost similar to the current value so it was quite interesting you can go to this bitx.la website and you can see different types of uh, apis you can also build a sample project to track the bitcoin values so you can just play with it to learn about this api it was very interesting for me to learn so I thought I can share with my subscribers and viewers. Friends, hope this small information about Bitcoin API is useful. All the best for your career. Thank you.